Welcome back explorers, I'm Alistair. I'm Douglas and this is the Highland Hikers. So thank you for joining us again today. We are out on a much, much, much more, much, much <laughs> relaxed day. Uh, we're out with the kids and we are down in Ayrshire to do what in terms, well for us, is quite a, a small hill. Uh, yeah, definitely. So we've got Loudon Hill behind us. You can probably see it back there. It's a volcanic plug and it's a very short walk, measuring in at only two and a half kilometers and just 161 meters of ascent. So you could be up and down this in an hour, I would suggest. Yeah. Uh, but that's how we brought the kids along. Uh, you know, have a nice easy afternoon out with them. Yeah. And uh, I still have a backpack and considering this is such a short walk, I seem to have tons of stuff packed into it. I have no idea why I've got like jumpers, <laughs> juice bottles and all sorts of snacks just to kind of feed them and keep them going. So uh, I feel like I, I've got more today than I would have going up a couple of in rows. <laughs> oh, it's always the case when you go out with the kids, you end up just overloading the bag. But what we need to do at some point is get them their own backpacks and then they can carry their own stuff. That that is the trick right there. Yes, yes, that would involve them coming yes. out on a more uh, regular basis, mind you. So we'll see how that goes. But um, the, the hill, this walk today, as Dougie says, it is a volcanic plug and it has overseen kind of two kind of major battles several hundred years ago. Yeah, it was the Scottish Wars of Independence fought against the English. So you had William Wallace, uh, who the Spirit of Scotland silhouette behind us is, is of William Wallace and that was the first battle in 1297. And then we had Robert the Bruce uh, fighting again 10 years later in 1307. And if that uh, silhouette is anything to go by, <laughs> William Wallace was mighty, mighty tall. <laughs> oh yes, indeed. <laughs> but yeah, we are looking forward to this walk. Uh, we're going to head on. It's quite steep, but short. So um, yeah, it should be a good one. So along the way, find this wee L-shaped ruin just along the path. And uh, the OS map shows this footprint of a, an L-shaped building, but it doesn't have a name on it that I could see there. But it does look fairly old. I'm kind of curious as to, to what it once looked like, what it was used for. So after a relatively short walk, we are at the top, unsurprisingly. 
Yeah, that was what, 45 minutes at the most, I oh. think, to get here. And we faffed around for a bit looking at ruined monuments and gates and stuff like that. Yeah, just letting the kids run, yeah. run wild, <laughs> expel some energy. So hopefully they will sleep well tonight. But it's a, it's a great viewpoint up here. Yeah, it certainly is. You can see out to Aaron, which is looking quite nice just now. And uh, you can see over to Whiteley Wind Farm as well. We're up at 316 metres right now, so it's not the, not the tallest by any means, but certainly in the area, there's not much around it that's, that's bigger than that. Yeah, it is. It's, a, it's quite a vast viewpoint, like Dougie says. You can see over to Aaron. I was hoping to see Elsa Craig. <laughs> it has been a long time uh -huh. since we've seen that from the top of a, a hill or a mountain. Well, a couple of years actually, I think. Uh, yeah, uh -huh. well, you saw it when you did Hill of Steak not too long ago. That was 2020. Oh my god. That was like, so when it was like just at kind of the end of lockdown sort of thing when you could travel to the edge of your council area or wherever. But no, that was three years yeah. ago, surprisingly. You were certainly kicking the arse out of <laughs> I'll just travel to the local, to the end of my. <laughs> Council area to do the hill of steak when you stay in Renfrewshire, Ren not East Renfrewshire. Sure? No, I think it was technically within the <laughs> within the letter of the law. <laughs> oh, anyway, those times are long past us now. But yes, yeah, it's, it's a great viewpoint. It is very windy today. Yes, it's not meant to be that windy, but. Uh, I mean, I suppose that's why the wind farm is near here because it's yes. a windy location. That that would make sense, but uh, it's good to be back out again. Yes, definitely. That is us back down near the car park, just at what looks like a wee picnic area. Yeah, it's a bit huge though. Yeah. Not like your standard picnic areas. Um, but yes, it was a, a very enjoyable day out. It's been a while since we've been out and yeah, it's just good to, to stretch the legs and see something that we haven't seen before. Definitely, and really enjoyed taking the kids out as well. It looked like they had loads of fun, which is always good. And um, yeah, I mean, if you're looking for a short family walk, south side of Glasgow, it only took us an hour and a half and we spent plenty of time messing yeah. about. So yeah, it's not, not long at all, but nice walk with great views. Yeah, the kids have already been asking, can we do this again? Can we do this again? Uh, yes, okay, so <laughs> I, I will be purchasing hiking boots, I'm sure, for the uh -huh. kids, which they'll grow out of in six months. Ah, that's what happens with kids, but um, I no, it was good, good. Yes, so we have plans for the future. I'm going to be heading out a wee bit more often and um, They'll be certainly taller hills than this, <laughs> that's for sure. And if you have enjoyed it, give us a wee thumbs up and we shall see you on another hike.